What's up guys, Seb here in Santa Monica. My tip for the day is directly related to LinkedIn and it's more of like a PSA, guys. If you're selling a service on LinkedIn, please stop selling a service on LinkedIn, man. Just, just get out there and provide some value. If you're a certified financial planner, you can't come at me all day, every day and say why your team is the best, why your platform is awesome, why your company is number you know three for whatever reason, uh, why this new position is so great. Like It's literally just about you and your service, you and your service, and you're not providing me with any value. You're not giving me something where I wanna engage with or maybe you know think about, and then further down the line, I'm like, oh yeah, you know what? Uh, if I'm gonna consider financial planning, I'm gonna hit up this guy right here, right? Or if I'm gonna buy insurance, I'm gonna hit up this lady right here. Like, you need to provide value. And this goes the same for brands, for direct-to-consumer brands, for SaaS, for services. I talk about this in marketing all the time. If you're on LinkedIn providing content and just putting out content, don't make it about the service that you're selling all the time. Provide value that's potentially related to the service so that people later on can consider you as a potential voice in the industry or you know, you've know remained top of mind awareness, guys. So anyway, more of a PSA, stop selling all day. And as Gary Vee would say, it's like jab, 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 right hook, jab, 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 left hook, right? You gotta give, 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 maybe ask a little bit, right? So anyway, guys, that's it for today. Peace.